Can you see what is blocking progress on your projects? Momentum is key, and having that visibility as to who or what might be slowing things down is critical. My name is Rich Coles, Managing Director of Productive, and we're on a mission to help people around the world transform execution and unlock potential. And we do this primarily using Smartsheet, which is a fantastic platform for collaboration and for project management. So let's have a look at what I mean in this case. So here I've got a time plan, which is one of the fundamental pieces that you will use in a project. There's so many other elements within Smartsheet that you can use, but in this case, I'm going to dive straight into the time plan. And here you can see there are various tasks and a couple are showing as overdue. So there could be various things that are blocking that progress, but simply put, if you mark them as blocked, then we've set up this way to actually bring in the information immediately saying, what are the predecessors that could be blocking it? Or what are the successors that will be impacted if this is blocked? So if we look at this, it's immediately saying that the tasks that are ahead of this are gate one and concept development and the qualitative concept research as well. So you can see these items are above it. So these are items that could be blocking the progress. And if it's blocked, then it's saying, well, the sourcing assessment, which is the next task, is also going to be blocked as well as gate two, as well as product development. And let's just block this one. And you can see it's showing all the items above and items below, which is sourcing decision agreed. Now, you can look at the predecessors and you can create a formula for the successors and it gives the numbers. But we feel that having visually be able to see the names of the items is much quicker and easier. Now, this solution, it is a bit complex in that in order to have this working, you need a series of columns added. And so here we've got all these ones from here to here. I'm just going to highlight them. So we've added in a series of ones, row ID, row, successors, predecessor, etc., etc. Now, rather than me going through and showing you the formulas on here, and you start having to write down all those formulas, we're making it really simple. So in our simple project solution, I've added these in and you can download these as a template. And then the formulas are there for you to take away straight away. Again, we're on that mission to help people transform their execution. So Take this, download it, and then you'll be able to access these for free and be able to start using it. And therefore, this is the version that you'll be able to download. It won't have any information in like this one does. But as you go in, you'll be able to then start playing around and seeing that if these tasks here are blocked, task one is blocked and task two, you can see these items. And let me just turn this off. Here we go. You can see what items are blocked coming downstream. So. This is how it works. Again, series of formulas that sit behind it and a series of hidden columns. So when you download it, just right click and unhide all columns and you'll be able to see the hidden columns that sit behind it. These are the ones here. And if you want to dig in and understand what those formulas are, go ahead. And then you can see again within Smartsheet is all about seeing how you can make the progress, how you can understand what you need to do to make your projects and work with your teams better. Again, in this same solution, when you download it, you will be able to access the dashboard that you get within it. So I'm not going to save. So the dashboard comes with this, as you'll be able to see on the website. And there's so much more within Smartsheet. So if you're not already using Smartsheet, you can download and you can get a free trial here. Or there's so many more videos that we've got and so many different versions we've got where people are using Smartsheet to really make that difference for their project management. So thanks for watching. Hopefully you'll find many other videos that are useful and get in touch if you want to know any help. Bye for now.